catch more of Rick's reviews on KGET.com. And sure enough, he is back in studio talking about Book Club, the next chapter. Rick, how's it going? It's going great. Happy Friday. Happy Friday to you. All right, so talk a little bit about Book Club, the next chapter. What's this all about? Well, talking about going from a good TV show to a bad Ooh, movie. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Look, I'm suggesting we put out an arrest warrant right now for Bill Holderman, who was the writer director of Book Club, the next chapter, and Aaron Sims. Because if they took money for writing this script, it's grand theft larceny Ooh. and creating a public nuisance. What they've done is they've tried to coddle together a bunch of funny ideas that are, first off, aren't funny and don't work together. For me, it's like saying, look, I'm going to take a bowl, put some eggs, some milk, and sugar in it. That's a cake. No, it's not. You have to work on it. And he didn't, none of, nobody works on this, this movie. It is a, a lame attempt to try to find humor for a sequel that I don't think anybody was clamoring for. I was going to ask because, you know, you look at the cast and you're like, oh, this would be great. Yeah. And listen, I am a big fan of all four of these women. Jane yeah. Fonda, Candace Bergen, Mary Steenburgen, and Diane Keaton. They are Hollywood gems. Don't get me wrong. That's but not I'm, the problem. But it's not the problem. And I'm getting tired of critics and, and people trying to say, well, we got to cut them some slack. At least they gave these veteran actors work. Yes, but give them something to do. This is a, a lame setup of these, free, these people were friends. When they were young, they wanted to go to Tuscany. Well, now they've decided to go as sort of a bachelorette party for the Jane Fonda character getting married. And let me tell you, here's how you can tell when you know a movie is bad. If in the opening 10 minutes, somebody says, hey, we may be going to Italy. You know, when I was younger, I had a, a crush on a guy in my, my uh, cooking class who was Italian. And you know where that's going to lead to. You know it's a bad movie. It's all so predictable. So when it, where is the where can you view this? Well, it's at the theaters it's right now. It's at the now. theaters, okay. Uh, unfortunately, there's a lot of other good movies to see other than that. But it is it did open in theaters, and again with that cast, you almost have to put it in big theaters. So what's your rating? I'm giving it, and, and this is a very generous D plus. Okay, so who would who do you think would enjoy this? Anyone? Well, it's obviously aimed at uh, a more mature audience, uh -huh. probably female oriented, but I don't think it's aimed at anybody. Okay. I think it's aimed at, can we suck a few dollars off some people and get out of here and put it on cable? So you would recommend maybe going to see another movie if you're going to the theaters? Oh yeah, there's plenty out there to see other than yeah. that. So yeah, this is just one of those, this is one that I used to talk about, if it's a Saturday afternoon and it's raining and it comes up on one of the, pre one of the cable channels, you might sit through it right. to get that nap. Otherwise, skip it. All right, so there you go. So that is the review for Book Club, the next chapter. Rick Bentley, thanks so much. Appreciate it. My pleasure, <laughs> trust me.